Federal investigators now trying to figure out what caused an explosion in downtown Atchison, Kansas. A blast caused damage to several businesses. 41 Action News reporter Ray Daniel in Atchison with a closer look at the damage. I'm here along North 8th Street where that explosion started right at that barber shop, impacting businesses across the street. Now this small and quiet town of Atchison is now rattled. An explosion that has this community shaken. We don't have a lot of activity. Something like this is and have to wake the town up. Eight businesses felt the impact of the explosion, including Snowball Cafe. We got the repercussions of windows, the canopy. Collins and others pick up the pieces from their shops. Whatever it was, was pretty powerful. The close-knit community hopes to find answers. I don't see why anybody would risk hurting other people's personal property. ATF, the Kansas State Fire Marshal, Atchison Police and Fire and Kansas Highway Patrol are looking at this as a criminal investigation. You don't want to see this happen anywhere um, and certainly this community is, is shaken. It's still early in the investigation and uncertain of what caused the explosion. Thankfully, no one was hurt. And certainly a, a blast this size could have could have caused injuries. We're lucky that it happened at a, at a time of, of day or early morning where there was no pedestrian traffic or even vehicular traffic. The town was supposed to be getting ready for first Friday. Fix the worst time possible, which is no good time, but uh, there would actually be you know, hundreds of people on this street tonight. Collins is hoping a senseless act will not ruin this town's tradition. We're still going to go on, whether we're open or not. First Friday will be on in Atchison, so they didn't slow that down none. Barriers are still put up behind me, but it's not putting a hold on First Friday. As you can see, tents are being put up. In Atchison, Kansas, Ray Daniel, 41 Action News.